Alright YouTube, um, it's iPodman711 here, and I'm going to be showing you guys how to SSH today. And first what you need to do is, um, actually we're going to go to the computer right now. And this is for the iPod Touch 2nd generation, and this is for the newest jailbreak. And I'm going to be doing this on Windows Vista, and you can also do this on XP. So... I'm going to switch to the computer screen now and I'll show you what to download and what to do. Okay, so at the computer, um, go into your Internet Explorer, your Mozilla Firefox or whatever you have for your internet. And type in, in Google, type in Win SCP. Alright, so you can click on this one, the first one, and you could download the newest version, which is 4.1.8, and just download it, do the installation package. And just download that. This is for Windows and Windows Vista. So it'll give you it'll give you the um file and set up, but I I already, I already done it. So just download that, and then when you're done with that, it should look something like this. WinSCP right here. When you click in it, let it load. Okay, it give you um it doesn't give you this, but what we, you what you would need to do is go into new, and just from here we're gonna keep this down for now. And we're going to switch back to our iPod because we need to download some things. So just come back, all right? Okay, so at your iPod screen, go into Cydia. And in Cydia, we're going to download two files that we need for um, to en enable the SSH. Well, let me just put my internet connection on. Okay. Alright, sorry about that. So go into Cydia. You could start right now, guys. Um, sorry if it's taking so long, but what you want to do is just go into the search menu and type in open SSH. No, no um, space. And then it should look like that. Click onto it and install in the top right corner. And... When you're done with that, just go back into the search menu and type in, sorry, no. Okay, type in um, mobile mobile terminal, and there you go, the first one, mobile terminal, as you can see there, 
and click on it and then install that and then from there we're done with Cydia and then we should mobile terminal should look like something like that what you need to do is click onto it okay it's gonna give you um the screen with it says iPhone the name well the name of your iPod and it says mobile so what you need to type in here you need to type in SSH space root at root at um your IP address after so it's root at and then your IP address so whatever one nine two point blah 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 and then just type whatever you have there then press enter you're not gonna get that just don't worry um i just didn't want to put my real ip address but it's just gonna go to the next line and then you're gonna type in alpine a l p i n e and then you're gonna press return and just don't worry, these words aren't going to come up. It's just going to be two lines for you. That's just because I didn't type in the real stuff. Okay, so then, then from that, we're done with the iPod. And we're going to go back to the computer for more SSH. Okay, so when you need to log in for WinSAP, it's going to ask you for a host name, a username, and a password. The host name is going to be your IP address. So whatever you typed in the mobile terminal, you're going to put here. I forgot what I typed in, but I think I did like something like this. And then the username has to be root, R-O-O-T. And the password has to be Alpine, A-L-P-I-N-E. Then you just press save, and then you go to storage sessions, and you double click on that one. And then it should do this for you. It'll ask you for your password, Alpine. A L P I N E. Press OK. And there you go. You SSH into your iPod. So I hope this helped you. And if it did, subscribe and rate and comment. So um, peace out.